Let's take you through the different features and functionalities available in the MSB Item Folders section. You can access your MSB Item Folders by logging into your Enterprise Portal and going to the MSB Item Folders. An item folder is a group containing passwords, cards, and or secure notes. Item folders can be shared with one user or with a user group. You can also apply security policies and rules to these item folders. Item folders can be used to organize items into categories and are great in case of external collaborators. You can share access to a specific item with them without including them in your company's departmental groups. To access your MSP item folders, log into your enterprise account, go to Enterprise Portal, and select MSP item folder. In the MSP item folder, there are three columns, the name of the item folder, the description of the item folder, and the number of items in that folder. To search for a specific item folder, you can use the search bar on the top right hand side of the list. To add or import different folders, you can either do it manually or import them using the different available methods. To delete an item folder, right click on this item folder's row and select delete item folder. To preview it, simply hit the preview button when you hover over the required item folder. A window pop-up will appear on the right with general information. You can also delete the item from this window. For additional information on a specific item folder, you can click on the item folder's name to access the item folder info section. On the left side, you will find the selected item folders card that includes the items folder general information, such as name and description, and you can also delete the item folder from here. On the right hand side of the item folder info page, you have access to different tabs. The item folder tab includes general information about the item folder, including the item folder items, which is the list of items in the item folder. Item folder users is a list of employees that have access to this item folder. Item folder groups, the list of all the groups this item folder is assigned to. And finally, item folder policies, the list of policies applied to this item folder. In the items access tab, you will find all the items in your MSP vault. To add items to the item folder, check the box at the left of the item's name and hit save. To remove an item, simply uncheck the box. To search for a specific item, use the search bar at the top right of the item's access page. You can also create an item directly from the page by clicking on Create Item at the top right of the page and filling in the required information. In the Users Access tab, you will find all of the users in your account. To assign the item folder to a user, simply check the box at the left of a user's name and click Save. To unassign the item folder, simply uncheck the box. To search for a specific user, use a search bar at the top right side of the Users Access tab. You can choose to show or hide the passwords of the item folder with your users. In the Group Access tab, you will find all the MSP groups available in your account. To assign an item folder to a specific group, simply check the box at the left of the group's name and click Save. To unassign the item folder, uncheck the box. To search for a specific MSP group, use the search bar at the top right of the group's access tab. You can also create a group directly from the page by clicking on Create a Group at the top right side of the page and filling in the required information. In the Security Policies access tab, you will find all the security policies set up in your MSP Policies section. To enforce a security policy on an item, simply check the box at the left of the security policy's name and hit Save. To unassign it, uncheck the box. To search for a specific security policy, use the search bar at the top right of the Security Policies Access tab. You can also create a security policy directly from the page by clicking on Create a Policy, selecting which type of policy you'd like to create and filling in the required information. To go back to the MSP item folders, simply click on the item folders at the top left of the item folder card or on the MSP item folders in the navigation bar. At any point in time, you can find us on live chat, available on the app, the portal, and the website.